I fell into the game with instant kill chapter. Tear bun and thank you to Jagetted Reader for sponsoring chapters. Then let's eat, Lion licked his lips and looked at the chicken in front of him. When I said that I would pay for the meal, he took a seat and sat down without the slightest hesitation. I was curious about the fried chicken dish so I wanted to try it but it was too expensive so I was about to order something else, haha, <laughs> thanks to the young master and now able to eat this. As he picked up a chicken leg with his hand and brought it to the plate in front of him, the expressions on Asher's and Bo's faces changed. Originally, it's okay to pick it up with your hand so wanted to eat comfortably, but I had to use a fork because it's a matter of dignity, as I took one leg. The other two also took their share, Asher, who was unfamiliar with the food, did not dare to put it in her mouth and just stared at the part of the thigh that she had taken, and then she cut off the tip with a knife and ate it. She then looked a little startled and started eating faster and faster, it seemed to suit her taste, it tastes as good, it was chicken with its own unique taste different from the familiar taste, how could a dish with fried meat not taste good? As we ate in silence for a while, the manager served drinks we didn't even order, thank you so much for helping the waiter, I won't charge you for the food so please enjoy it, after saying that, he looked at me with a worried look and continued talking, hey young master, Lady Denbre, whom you had a quarrel with earlier it's okay, just go to work, he seemed to try to warn me about that idiot, the manager backed away hesitantly, and Lion, who had chicken buns piled up on the plate in front of him, asked me, but would you really be all right with young master? If her father is the mayor wouldn't he be like the king of this city, if you knew that why did you try to help the waiter, well no matter the situation is, I can't just watch people being beaten like that, and to be honest, I didn't even know if that woman was the mayor's daughter, and not from this city, wouldn't you help if you knew? No, I would still have stepped out and help, of course, I didn't expect my hand to be cut off her. He laughed and talked, as if he was talking about someone else and not himself, as one could see, this man had such an optimistic personality, even in the game, he smiled like this until right before he met his end, but she seemed to be a, well, weird woman, I know this is off topic, but it might be better for you to leave the city as soon as possible, young master returned the topic to something else, looking at your behavior, you seem to be a wanderer. Ah, yes, in wandering around Kolderik right now. Why, if you ask me why what is the reason for the wandering of a traveler? A smile hung on his lips, but somehow it sounded a little empty, because I knew what his situation was now. Even if he went back, anyone would not welcome him, and he couldn't bear to completely sever his kinship with his family. Of course, what I was paying attention to right now was not his background, but something else, the reason I was holding on to him and having a conversation was because there was something I wanted to confirm. Hmm. How did I spot the enemy ambush when there was no sign? Haha, <laughs> because I have a good sense. Okay, you've helped me a lot, so I'll let you know in particular, don't tell anyone, please keep it a secret, in fact, I have a mystery, in the Earth Hill Kingdom episode, during the war with the enemy. This was the line that Lion, or Teobaman, gave to the player. It's not exact, but I remembered him saying something like this. He was an extremely rare mystery user on this continent. He meant that there was a mystery that he held like me, he said. I don't know what its name was. It was a mystery that amplified my senses and reflexes, thanks to his mystical abilities. He was never caught or ambushed by the enemy during the war. He also defeated enemy generals much stronger than himself, even with his not-so-great physical abilities. There was one thing I wanted to check was this the point before or after he gained the mystery. How did I get the mystery? That was just a coincidence, there was a time when I was wandering around the continent until a few years ago. I also worked as an adventurer, and I also explored uninhabited areas, somehow, as an antique store. A torn map was touted as a treasure map, it was a map showing the location of a dungeon, and that's where I got mysteries, as I recalled, he said he got a mystery from a dungeon marked on the map. He roughly mentioned the location in the dialogue, but unfortunately I couldn't remember that far.